All right, so I wanted to use the 102 speaker, and I noticed that the cord on the 901 was the same din pin. Uh, I found a couple of pretty bad surprises already. So this one here, guy had two of these on his table. I don't know if I grabbed the bad one or not, but I just got some, you know, damage to it here and there. But um, I got into here, and I'm like. Oh, so this wire's not hooked? Huh, weird. And then I looked in here, and I'm like... Well, it definitely looked like somebody attempted to move those around, or did move them around, or something. So, um... I was curious, and I wanted to figure out what this looks like. And this is after... I've moved everything away from touching everything. So, um, yeah, I'm going to have to redo this for sure. Um, so I'm going to have to look this up and find out what it calls for on the uh, other radio. Make sure that they're the same. I have a manual for an SP-102, but not a 102 patch. So, um... Pretty bad. So, so what I'm trying to do here is just figure out, well, okay. We've got audio on these two pins here and here. And a ground in the center. And I don't think that's how this one's set up at all. So, it's possible that this was like for a different radio and the guy messed with it or something but um it was connected on here to there on the other radio other speaker i mean i have a 902 speaker so you look down in here you will see that our audio is absolutely opposite on this so there's nothing on these pins over here but it looks like there was um, let me get in here. There, w there was right here. And the, uh, the shield is connected to the center on one of them. Well, it should be nice if this thing would focus. But I think they moved these. Honestly. Of course, the other one might be wrong too. I don't know. So we'll get to the bottom of it. 